When I think about obstacles, I often try to reframe them as opportunities. And so whether I succeed at the opportunity or fail at the opportunity, I really try to look and maximize my opportunities for growth and learning in that instance. Sometimes you need to take a step back, reevaluate, do a little bit more research, figure out what your core goals are, and come at things from a different angle. Life is going to be full of many challenges. Turn those challenges into opportunities. Know what your values are and then truly go for it. Accomplish what you want to do, own it, take risks, and don't look back. Finding your inner self and finding a way that you could actually harness that to be successful. So obstacle is just a way to get to the end goal, which is being strong. Just never give up. Always try to persevere. Uh, being in a STEM field, it was always, you know, kind of a, you're the only girl here. Do you really belong? But really, women belong just about anywhere. As long as you work hard, you should deserve to go anywhere. I think authenticity works a lot in, in a lot of ways to help you overcome obstacles and really be centered in who you are as an individual is so very important. Wherever possible, surround yourself with really, really good people and stick with it. Be flexible and sometimes that means working late at night and on the weekends to get the job done um, and other times it means bringing my daughter to um, meetings or to a photography session for example. So finding a balance between work and family. I think when you find yourself in a difficult situation and you know you're going to laugh about it later on, find the funny in the moment. Uh, it'll help you get through those tough times. They need to get involved uh, to make a difference. If it's an obstacle, you need to take a step forward. When we find what it is that we want to work hard at, work and strive every day to work towards, we find our tribe. When we find our fellow travelers on this journey of what we care about so deeply, then we overcome obstacles. Just believe in yourself and continue to be persistent and never take no for an answer. If it were easy, everybody would do it, right? That was some great advice that a friend of mine gave me. If it were easy, everybody would do it. So if it's worth doing, it might be a little challenging. You're going to have to come at it from different angles. But if you really, really want it, you got, you got to keep going for it. The key is perseverance, and that comes with confidence. So do whatever you need to do to be confident in the situation. What truly is your goal? Don't get stuck on, on the little things that get in the way, but stay focused on the goal. Don't abandon your passion. Work hard, and most importantly, keep your sense of humor. One of the things that I think is a key to success is flexibility. One of my favorite sayings is when a horse bucks you off, get right back on, a different horse. My piece of advice is, it's a motto I live by, it's that those who do, do, and those who don't, quit. So my advice is never quit, hold on to your dreams. As women, we can do anything. We can set the world on fire if we're working and striving towards what we care about every single day. Don't be afraid to ask people for help. Find someone who has gone before you or, or has overcome a similar obstacle. Uh, talk with them, email them, tweet them, phone them, do whatever you can to reach out and make a connection there because if there's one thing I've experienced in our community is that women are so willing to help.